So, oh, how's everyone's day been? You know, it is 10.47, where I am right now. Uh, next stop, 100th floor. Um, I'm going to have to finish recording this, and then edit this, and then holy shit, I'm going to be tired as hell. Not to mention, I have to wait for this thing to export, and exporting always takes forever! I don't want to sleep with the computer sound on. It sounds awful. <laughs> oh god. Don't tell me I'm getting hiccups now. Look, I don't know what 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 it's about, Ben. I think I think my dinner was a little too big, if you know what I mean. This is the wonderful hippo pool. Here you can swim with hippo launchers, gaze at hippo launchers, and observe hippo launchers eating. You can even fight them. That's dangerous, though. Dangerous is my middle name, buddy. Let's do this. Damn straight. Hippo launcher, all right. Considering that the revitalization machine is right next to me, I will gladly be taking this fight. Now, uh, let's see here. Honestly, I might be doing a little too much, but you know what? There's never anything called too much. Uh, shield snatcher. Did not have a shield. Cool. Loser! Loser! Alright, we got a good old counter. I still don't know if the counter is gone after one use. Because I kind of did just smoke facade. Like it was nobody's business. Uh, offense up. I also realized I probably should have done defense up back then, but you know what? Oh well. You live once, you learn once. Also, I just realized I also probably should have sniffed to see what uh, what uh, this this guy's cooking. But you know what? I, th I think this is fine. I think this is fine. Let's see what happens if I just do this. I feel like this should be enough, should it not? Loser! Loser! Oh, would you look at that? That was very much quite enough. Oh, I just realized. I just realized. I'm going to have to be. Oh, you're joking me! These are the guys who I'm going to have to be going against. Well, I guess it's a good idea for me to sniff at them. I was like, weak against lightning, weak against sleep. Pickle stick. Loser. Actually, no, I'm more of the loser because I still got hit by that. There's no counter. No counterplay whatsoever. I swear, if I go to the revitalization machine, and I find that these two fuckers are back again, I'm gonna be uber pissed off. Not good, not good, not good. Does like, does a shield not work on that? Do I, do I have to use, do I have to use like a PSI shield? Does a, a regular shield not fucking work on that? If it doesn't, then that sucks ass! All right, I am very low already. So, like I said before, I better not see fucking uh, two hippos, two hippo launchers over there by the time I get out of this device. Look at that, no hippos. Hip Hippopotami that have been fancied up and equipped with powerful missiles, incredibly popular even among women and senior citizens. The premise to create household pet versions are currently unavailable. Or whatever that said, because I didn't bother reading that. Useless. Alright, uh, you know the drill. I don't really show any of these fights these days anymore. So, I'll be back. What do we have over here? A super bomb. Interesting, interesting. Uh, I just realized these guys are actually, I don't know if I want to call them a pa pacifists, 
bit, it seems like they won't attack me as long as I don't talk with them or interact with them at all. It appears that you guys appear to be suspicious guys. I'll beat you up good. Uh, go, go, go get him, Hippo Launcher. Buddy. Buddy. Really? Really? You're really gonna be doing this shit to me? Really? Uh, honestly, the defense down on these guys is probably the best thing that I have going because these guys have actually quite, quite huge defense. So, just a little bit of defense down. Ouch, ouch, ouch. And just a little bit of offense up. Everyone sauced up. Actually, what I could try doing is using more PK Lightning. PK Thunder, whatever it's called. At the same time, that's just more PSI. And like, this tried and true method already works, so like, why bother? Alright, your shit's dead. Ah! Oh! Uh, my hippo launcher! Uh, I'll curse you! Uh, you'll pay for this! Loser! Stupid heads! Alright. Uh. No, do not interact with me. I just want the present. Some ultimate shoes. Let me go through here. There's another hippo, another hippo. Please, for the love of God. Ultimate shoes, ultimate shoes, ultimate shoes. Duster! Uh, what do they do? No. Equip. Wrong button. Good choose. Uh, damn. That's slower speed. That sucks. My good choose compared to my ultimate choose. Uh, anything over here? Nope. There's presents over there. Alright, I know what to do now. What's up, my guy? You have such cute butts. Don't you agree? Uh, no. I very much not agree now the question is how do i get down there Ooh, so there's another room don't interact with them at all do not interact with the hippo whatsoever you leave me alone leave me the fuck alone leave me the fuck alone grilled chicken i love grilled chicken Cup of life noodles, that'll go great with grilled chicken. What now? We bring you a breaking news alert. Some idiots have been seen pretending to be sea monkeys in the middle of a pond. <laughs> I'm talking about you guys getting all covered in mud so you can fight for your lives. It's so, it's all so ridiculous. All right then, get on the next elevator. I think I'm going to sit back and watch more of your stupidity in action. Come on, don't give up. So close to the real 100th floor now. <laughs> okay, buddy. You don't need to be much of a dick about that. Alright, so let's see here. Cup of life noodles to Duster. His inventory is full. God damn it. You the bony. And. There we go. Thank you. Let's get up this elevator. Thank God I did not have to deal with many hippopotamus, hippopotami, whatever the plural is. Lord, was I even on? Next stop, 100th floor. Oh, you already told me that the next, well, the, the last stop was the 100th floor. Who do you think you are? All right, what do I got over here? It appears to be a present, but it's unopenable, unusable, and untakeable. That sucks. Uh, what the hell am I looking at? You, uh, what? Your attention, please. We have a report of lost children. The detestable Lucas and his pals appear to be lost in Master Porky's fan room. <laughs> attention, Lucas and friends. Come to the real 100th floor immediately, if you dare. <laughs> I'm trying to get there. But your bitch ass does not leave the elevator straight to the 100th floor. Want some oxygen for old time's sakes? 
No. <laughs> this is the gathering room for Master Porky's fans. Can you guys put your hands to your chest and say from the bottom of your heart, No. Quit lurking around and get out of here. Favorite double chocolate fried pork chips? That sounds disgusting. That just sounds disgusting. That's an insult to both fucking chocolate and to pork chips. Some good chicharrones. Come on now. Oh, there's another elevator. Buddy, how many elevators do you have? I swear to God, this one better not take me to the first fucking floor. I'm going to lose it. I want to go to sleep soon, buddy. Next stop, 100th floor. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what they all say. Instant revitalizing device. Yes, sir. Do not care if I am full health already. I will always take this device because it is really useful. It is beautiful. I'll never say no to it. Never. Uh, women, men, women, men, women. Uh, let's see. How diabolical is Master Porky or Pokey is? An attack detractor. Cool. What does it do? Causes an enemy to stink, thereby making it a target of everyone's attacks. Don't I already have that? I swear, I thought I already have one of those. Oh. Well, uh, I guess I'll give it a bony. That's about it that I can give it to him. Wow. Wow. <laughs> okay, buddy. And he just died in one turn. You really thought you could gang up on me, huh? It looks like someone was just using this. And you didn't flush the toilet, buddy. Someone's in here. Uh, go through here. That's not the right one. Sorry, I'm a little busy at the moment. Save it for later. All right. God damn it! Whew, made it just in time. Oh, Bru <laughs> buddy, buddy, <laughs> where did the men's room sign come from? I'm going to assume that's the right door. Any a star storm? No shot. No shot. When the fuck does the men's bathroom sign is able to use star storm? Who thought of that? Present honey shower. I already have a honey shower. God damn it. Oh god damn it, there's gonna be another men's sign that comes after me, isn't there? Better not see a women's sign. And I start to feel feverish. Of course, right as Japanese style. Right as soon as I go to the women's restroom. Oh my lord, that is Japanese style. Uh over here. That seems to be the right room. <laughs> For big people, giant toilet. Reminds me of the giant toilet that I fucking saw in a Deltarune, a duck type. Oh, what the hell is with all these toilets? Alright, come on, Lucas. Can we stop being feverish for one minute, please? That's the one thing that I don't like about Mother 3 compared to the other Mother games is that even when I level up, I still have to go through this feverish thing. There we go. Yes, I counter Omega. I like that. I still have to go through this feverish thing instead of them just giving it to me straight away what the hell there must be something crazy going on inside this restroom huh hmm i'm jumping and flopping around because i want to don't worry uh and never mind me i'm fine here so please go away that's the right oh my god i have to deal with this dickhead again Present red color. Ooh, I'm gonna assume bony. Yep, that is for bony. Uh, just give it a Kumatora because I do not want it on Lucas. Here you go, bony. Finally, some even 
better equipment. That is the wrong one. Finally, some even better equipment. There we go. What the fuck is this? Oh, we're friendly ghosts who used to live in the easy life in Osoe Castle. But some pig masks crammed us all in here the other day. People give ghosts a cold shoulder whenever they don't seem mean. Ghost! They are indeed ghosts. Welcome! How good of you to visit! Wait a minute, what am I saying? This is a bathroom! What the heck's your problem? What are you doing in here anyways? All in a big group, no less. Uh, you know, just hanging around, doing whatever pals do. Jesus Christ! Out of the way, out of the way, out of the way. Alright. I mean, that the only... If, if all of those four bathrooms got taken by those other people, then in theory, this one should be open. Yup. I'm going to assume that it's... Yep, it's the red ones. Oh, would you look at that? That's disgusting, Jesus. <laughs> you seem to be having quite a tough time. Did you enjoy my special all-you-can-pee toilet dungeon? Now then, I have some sad news for you. The place you're at now isn't really the hundredth floor. It's a fake! <laughs> You're nothing but a cheap toy crawling around in the palm of my hand. Alright, allow me to invite you to the real 100th floor. For the elevator, just ahead. I'll be waiting for you. Uh, but do you have like... Okay, first of all, not gonna lie. Nice toilet. There's a sign that someone was here. Are you joking me? I have to wait for this to go away now? PK Fire Omega. Cool. Uh, let me just go save the game real quickly again, because I do not want to die right now. Actually, I kind of want to see what these guys have. What? What was that? Maybe it's not a, a good idea to go through there. I'm trying to eat here. That's gross. <laughs> Why are you trying to eat there? I just don't want to deal with another bathroom sign. A clean toilet is the mirror of the heart. Wipe it and polish it until it sparkles. Okay, buddy. Uh. Well. <laughs> Good thing I saved. Good thing I saved. <laughs> Did you look at that? Uh, he's in there again, isn't he? Yep, he's there. He is indeed there! Ooh! Awesome ring. What is that? Who can I give it to? Oh, what? Really? Okay, uh, heavy charm, other. Scorpio bracelet, defense plus 35. Uh, it's by five. Fuck it. I'll, I'll, I'll do it. Just because it gives me more PSI. And you can't go wrong with PSI. That's the one time. That's the one and only time I will ever, ever do that. God, this is such a chore to go through. Next stop, 100th floor. I've heard this. Blah, blah, blah. Alright. Sounds like a gypsy's room right now. Because would you look at that? It is. You guys have no tech whatsoever, do you? Get out of there and get on the next elevator and then make it a real 100th floor. Blah, blah, blah. <laughs> and everything. I get it. Hmm. 
The razor and lipstick. Whose razor and lipstick is it? Probably a memento of, Magip of the Magipsy Locria. Hmm. Luxury bananas everywhere. Or, I guess, banana. I mean, they are. They have to be luxury bananas. Right. Can I not open the damn prison? There we go. Yep, they're all luxury bananas. Uh, it's 120 HP, really. Pointless. Uh, remember what I said is facade Locria? The traitor among the Magipsies. Someone who not only must have known the secret, decided to work with Porky, knows about Tasmali Village. You're talking about facade, aren't you? Yep. Yep, who was right? Who was right this entire time? Squeak, squeak. I don't think Locria is coming back anymore. Oh, me? I'm a mouse Locria like to dote over. He had a creepy <laughs> laugh. So he might have seemed like a mean person in most people's eyes. But he was very nice to me, at least. You think he'll be coming back home soon? I'm so lonely. I'm sorry, little one, but Locria was actually a little bit of an asshole, not gonna lie. Next stop, Hundreds Floor. Yes, yes, yes. Finally, at least something to heal me up. I have been trying to look for an instant revitalizing machine, device, whatever, or a hot springs nearby, and there is nothing for me. Absolutely nothing! Honestly, it looks like I'm about to beat the game, and I really wish I had at least a little bit more time to beat it, but you know what? I... whatever. I'm, he I'm here. If I do beat it at the end of this night, uh, uh, so, so be it. So be it. Alright, buddy. Who the hell do you think you are? A boa transitor and its cohort. Uh, I do not really like who you are. You look scary. I am just going to pummel the living absolute shit out of you. Ouch. Eat shit. Eat shit. Nerd. Uh. Hey, 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 Who do you think you are, buddy? Bucko? I never asked you to go fight me. I just realized this thing is called a K9000. <laughs> I kind of get it. Although it doesn't look like a dog at all. The K9000. Nice pun. <laughs> I'll give you that. What is this? Where is all my guys? How good are you to come to this construction site? You're interfering with the construction, but I welcome you just the same. What's up, my guy? I probably don't need to tell you this, but whatever you do, do not tackle anyone. What, like this? <laughs> Thank you very much, my good sir. Do you guys have business here at this construction site? Do not get lost. Uh, I don't know about that. Damn, where am I supposed to go? I'm supposed to go here? Where are you? <laughs> you look weird! A love walker. Mm, Alright, just... Actually, just beat the living shit out. Oh, fuck me. This building's made out of concrete and lumber. Cool. Not like any other building. Actually, what do you have to say? Was that? Is this the hundred floor? You ask? Of course it isn't. Duh. All right, that's what you get. Don't touch danger. Pulling of this lever by anyone other than the construction personnel is forbidden. What am I doing here? You ask? What do you think? Construction work. Duh. Amateurs like you could never hope to understand how complicated this job is. All right. Uh, you mean this job? Nerd! That is what we call a nerd moment. Loser. Loser. What do we have over here? <gasps> Not just yet. Not just yet. 
Oh, what? I can't go up here? Really? Really? <laughs> Fucking hell. That was a close one. I know these guys are going to gang up on me right now, so I decided to take the liberty to heal up first. And now these guys are going to pummel me into oblivion now, aren't you? Not if I have anything to say about it, buckos. Because I have Kumatora, and she has what we like to call in the business, Starstorm. So you can do this little thing that I like to say, e eating shit. Just like that. They absolutely ate shit. Thank you very much, Kumatora. Really wish it didn't, it didn't cost 48 PSI powers, but you know what? Whatever. Would you look at that? Did I get the right plank? No? Uh, what? Was I supposed to go down? No, if I went down, then I'm not gonna get anything. What the hell is this? Attention workers! Some idiots have snuck onto the construction site and are causing loads of troubles! Idiots, idiots, idiots! You idiots! I'm talking about you guys! Come on now! How about you actually try to come to the 100th floor already? Really starting to irritate me. You're making my dentures itch like crazy! Get on the next elevator already! Dude, you, you, you're getting irritated? Man, why don't you shut the fuck up and actually come down here to whatever floor I'm in? I have no clue what floor I'm in right now. I want to go to bed. I still need to edit and export everything. You little bitch. You are wasting so much of my fucking time that I honestly cannot take it anymore. Uh, I just can't deal with your shit. <laughs> with your bullshit. What do we have over here? Some angel gloves. Uh, I'm going to assume that's for Kumatora, isn't it? Yes, it is. I will take it. Nothing wrong with a little bit more protection. I'm not gonna deal with you. Elevator goes up here. Let's go. I really hope there's a shop nearby so I can at least buy something. And for at least for me to sell some of the items that I have. Because god damn it. Some of these items that I have are really starting to fill up. The next top 100 floor. I get it. Oh my god, I thought there was a mole cricket there. I thought there was a mole cricket! <laughs> oh my god. How is Porky, Pokey, whatever, how has he managed to do all of this? What has he been cooking? Fucking useless. Worthless. Stop trying to go after me. You're, you're, you're doing nothing. Oh my god, was this the right floor for me to go through? I just wanna, I just wanna go through. <laughs> what the hell was that? What the hell was that? Bro, what was that? Just some fucking light comes and fucking destroys me? What kind of bullshit is that? How was I prepared for that? I was at full health! Yeah, 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 I already know your bitch ass does this shit. Just shut up. Go away. What the hell? I just lost a memento for nothing! Magic cake. King Burger, I'll take it. That's bullshit! Yeah, like, not gonna lie, I'll be like completely honest. Uh, these places aren't even interesting at all. And there's a present over there that I didn't get, but you know what? I honestly cannot be bothered anymore. I am just tired. <laughs> I'm just tired. I already have a honey shower. I don't need it. Uh, but... Fuck, I, I really wish I had that other... That other stupid, um... Memento, because that, 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 that's, that's bullshit! How all of a sudden I just fucking died and no goddamn reason. I was not prepared for that. 
How the fuck would anyone be prepared for that? Seriously. Ain't on weapon. Interesting. What is on this thing is freaking the fuck out again. To Bonnie. And uh, oh, cool. And <laughs> the the all the one and only weapon I've ever had Bonnie's ever had. What do I have to go all the way back? Really? Oh, you're joking me. I'm sorry, I wasn't paying attention. I was just mashing the A button. Did this asshole steal one of my double jerkies? Because if so, fuck you, buddy. You're just like the other Octobots from fucking Earthbound. Stealing my shit for no good reason. Yep, looks like he took one of my double jerkies. Son of a bitch. Ha! Loser! Loser! You really thought you could steal from me again? Loser! God, the amount of time that I take out of my day here at the night <laughs> trying to make content for you guys. You know, you should leave a subscribe. <laughs> you should leave a subscribe right now. Because I guarantee you that tomorrow when I have to wake up to go to school at 7 p 7 a.m. I guarantee you that I am going to be tired as fuck. Cool, whatever. Take the bug spray for all I care. I don't want it. All I just want to do is to go right now. Because my god, you guys are not interesting at all. I generally do not have anything to say or whatnot. Jesus, you guys just drag on this for way too fucking long. And there's another prison over there. Hello? This isn't a nice person. Hot spring using this will make you a nice person. Who respects Master Porky from the bottom of your heart? Use it until you feel right in the face and you'll feel happy and revitalized as a nice person. Unlike with regular hot springs, all you have to do is go inside a green colored capsule, which makes it very simple and convenient. Uh, no. I got a Sagittarius bracelet. I managed to go through everyone without getting beaten up. And would you look at that? I am going to place this on... Oh, wait. I can't do it on Lucas. Fuck! Uh, Lucas is really the only one who needs it. I'm fine. I guess I'll put it on Kumator again. Jesus. Maybe. Just maybe. The awesome ring is not the greatest investment that I should have done. But I am already balls deep in this now, so can't really can't really do much. Healing Omega. What does Healing Omega do now? Cures all status ailments, include all ally status ailments, including incap incapacitation. It's about time I could do all status now uh, all status ailments for everyone. Okay, you said there was a green hot spring for me somewhere over here. Am I correct? Am I correct? Uh, looks like you have basically done the exact same thing that Gygus did. In which he took everyone from... What was it? Uh, what was it called? I already forgot the name. Winters, there we go. Took everyone from Winters and decided to put them in glass. Your attention, please. You appear quite exhausted there, Lucas. But the real fun is just about to begin. Alright. Climb up the stairs just ahead. Come on. Don't disappoint me now. <laughs> God, I really wish I could. Hey, buddy. Buddy. What, can I not go through here? Alright, dipshit. But yes. Porky, Pokey, whatever the fuck his name is at this point in time. I don't give a shit. He is... Kind of right, and that I am a little exhausted, both in-game, uh, due to how much PSI power I've already had to use, both in-game and, by the way, I should actually do this, and IRL. So he is right about that. But I am not going down without a fight. That, I never, I never give up. You know, I have a job that I need to do, and I'll do it right. Master Lucas and friends, I have been waiting for you. 
I've changed my hat, so perhaps you don't recognize me. But I was the chauffeur of that difficult to drive and far too long limousine. I'm pleased to see that you've made it this far. I will now determine if you're fit to meet with Master Porky or not. Kindly follow me, if you would. Uh, hello. This is written on the cue card. Laugh, laugh. Uh, these don't look like real people. They just look like cutouts. Let's see here. Master Porky just loves to play fun games, so I will use this super whack-a-mole game to judge whether or not you're fit to be a wonderful playmate of his. First, allow me to explain the wonderful rules. Whoever hits the most moles with their m with their mental A button hammers will win the game. Master Porky absolutely adores the word win. If the words indulge and in humor mean anything to you, you'll know what to do. But if you try to throw the match, Master Porky will be very displeased indeed. Okay, do you understand the rules now? Sure. Hit the old guy in the helmet and you'll be zapped. Do try to be careful. Sounds easy. Just whack them all. Now then, let's bring out Master Lucas's competitor. Master Mini Porky! Interesting. Ready, Master Mini Porky? Begin! Uh. He seems very. unfit. Only two moles. Wow, simply amazing. You had a grand total of 10 moles. That, that was not 10. Did you not see that, buddy? That was two. All right, you're up, Master Lucas. God, my head hurts. All right. Buddy. All right. This doesn't seem too bad. Oh, I'm choking. I'm choking. Come on. This has to be, this has to already be more than 10. Oh, what? <laughs> he was right there. All right, all right, all right. Time. Now for the results. Master Lucas's record? Ta-da! Total moles hit 21! I could have done better though. I could have at least gotten 25. Uh, Master Lucas? What are you trying to pull here? You got all worked up and then... Bang! 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 I thought your hammer was going to break! Here, let me see your eyes. Whoa! They're bloodshot! I'm afraid I can't introduce someone as frightening as you to Master Porky. Try again, but this time with a fresh onlook on things. Alright, you said 10, right? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Alright, 6. Oh, 7. Eight, nine, ten, eleven. There, eleven. I'm fine with eleven. It's just one more than Master Mini Pokey's record. I'm completely fine with that. I'm gonna just drink some water here in the meantime. Eleven. Yes, sir. Master Lucas, what are you trying to pull here? Bro! 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 Are you telling me that I have to lose? Are you telling me I have to lose? All right, where's the old guys? I'm I'm going to be exclusively going after the old guys. I actually kind of like this game, not gonna lie. Oh, the old guy was right over there. Loser. <laughs> Loser. There, are two old guys. Is that good enough? He's gonna appear. He's gonna appear over here. Time. Now for the results. Master Lucas's record is zero. 
Master Lucas, you really should be more serious about this. Oh my god, do I have to get 10 exactly? I, I'm not gonna lie, I kind of really wish this was its own mini game <laughs> within the game. Like I said before, I'm actually kind of having a little fun with this. I'm having more fun with this than I am with the combat! Time! Now for the results. I hit 10. 10, there we go. Oh my god, dude! How many do you want me to hit? Dude, this is absolutely fucking rigged! One, two, uh, let's see here, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, nine, there we go. Are you happy with that? Are you happy with that? I'm just one below? You're one above me? Are you happy with that now, you little fuck? You know? 21 wasn't good enough for you. Uh, 11 wasn't good enough for you. Zero wasn't good enough for you. 10 wasn't good enough for you. Come on now. Ta da! Nine. Oh my! Master Mini Porky, you've won the intense match by the raises and margin of one mole! What a wonderful game! Truly heart-stopping! Now then, let's move on to the next fun and exciting game! Cool, so I'm supposed to lose by one against this asshole. No, of, of course I- of course I'm always supposed to lose. What- what am I thinking? Porky, Pokey, whatever! He doesn't want me to win, he wants me to lose! Why do you think he's brought me all the way over here? I I'm just stupid. It's my competitive nature. You know, after I reach gold on support and tank on Overwatch, I become a changed man. Alright, things are really heating up now. How much are we heating it up some? This looks like a race. I feel like I'm supposed to stop exactly right before the finish line next is the purple bridge race game you'll both start from a purple bridge at the same time and the first to reach the other side wins you understand the rules yes also if you have the two words indulge and divulge perhaps the former would be the one to focus on if you catch my drift do you understand yes i understand everything actually the one thing that i do not understand i when you're ready to go on to your starting position Actually, the one thing that I do not understand is what, what you mean by divulge and divulge and whatnot. But to be honest, at this point in time, I could not care less. Wow. Alright. I, I, I'm just gonna stay here. He is slow as fuck. He's just like the actual real Porky. Pokey, whatever. <laughs> he just saw me and he decided to book it. <laughs> well, are you happy now? Uh, Master Lucas? What are you? A turtle? A tortoise? A terrapin? Oh my god, do not tell me I need to do this all over again. It's because- it's because I waited. It's because- <laughs> Because I accidentally waited. I just should have done it immediately. Okay. Right here. As soon as he gets to number one. I thought I thought I thought when he when he went to number one, I thought that would have been it. I thought it would have been like time. But no, apparently I still have to move, so my bet on me. <laughs> it just looks so concerned. Oh my, Master Mini Porky, you win the intention, intense match by a nose. What a truly fantastic race. That was a match for the ages. Now then, let us move on to the third and final game. 
Dude, I bet you if I played any other games with this guy in real life, I would roll the absolute fuck out of him. I will also say that the one good side about recording right now here during the night is that I do not have to deal with my neighbor's dogs because they're most likely inside. The moment that I hear them go outside and start barking, I'm ending the episode. At last, we're at the final game. Please come this way if you would. Alright, what do we have over here? Final game is, to whom goes the boom? Alright, here's a quick explanation of the rules. Use your mental A button air pump to quickly inflate your balloon until boom, the first to pop his balloon wins. You understand the rules, right? Uh, yes, I do. And please go to your position. Alright, considering that I have no clue how long I'm gonna have to press the A button, I'll just... Now that I'm tripling the points for this final game, this means that you have a very good chance of coming from behind to win it all, Master Lucas. Please try your very best. Here we go. I'm gonna have to press the A button after this guy presses A. Whoa! How did... How is my... Oh! Oh! Hey! 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 Oh. Oh, would you look at that? I, 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 I still won. Lost. Whatever. You're so young. Yeah, you've mastered so much. I hereby deem you fit to meet Master Porky. Now then, please go and pay Master Porky a wonderful visit. Alright, but before that happens, your fly isn't open, don't worry about it. <laughs> oh my god. Now then, uh, what was I saying? Yes. Uh, chauffeur. Please, Tommy, instant revitalizing device. Hello, please, I need it. Por favor. Oh, it's a nice red velvet staircase that you have over here. God bless these frogs. God bless them. They're the only reason why I'm able to save this much. They're the only reason how am I able to save my sanity. Alright. I was not ready for this. Lucas, welcome to my room. This is the real hundredth floor that you wanted to come to oh so badly. Again, I welcome you, my beloved detestable pests. I was the one who invited you here. So you're free to come inside if you wish. It's just, I've given orders to let no one enter my room. To that little attack toy you see right there. Who knows? Maybe this is where we'll say goodbye even though I invited you here. Alright, let's turn it on. Say hello to the natural killer cyborg. Um... The NK cyborg suddenly attacked. Cool. And if you couldn't tell by that, that was sarcasm at its finest. Uh, I honestly do not want to use that much PSI, so I'm just going to offense and defense him down. There ain't no way. Oh, fuck. Ain't no way am I going to want to spend that much on him. Because God forbid, God forbid that there's another fucking boss right behind this place. Loser! Loser! Shit. Ah, uh, fine. Uh, I'll just use shield just because it's the most inexpensive one. Defense down. Uh, tickle stick. Loser! Defense down on him. Oh, please don't attack Boney. And you attack Boney. Oh. I hate this. I hate it over here. I hate it with a burning passion. Bo Boney's just dead. Just like that. Immediately. Alright, 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 alright. I got this. I got this. I got this. I don't got this. I. <laughs> Uh, let's see here, let's see here, let's see here, let's see here. Defense down, and... 
Cup of Life Nibbles. Okay. I'm using a lot more defense up than I would really like to, but you know what? It's for a cause. You think you can counter me, buddy? You think you can counter me, bucko? That's what I thought. Loser! Loser! This is what I like to see. Big numbers! And I haven't needed to use that much PSI. I've only needed to use like 30 on fucking Lucas and then like what? 40? 50 on Kumatora? Actually that might be even more. Realistically speaking. But that doesn't matter because this man is eating shit as we are speaking. Also, I just realized I also never ended up getting that fucking huge combo ever again after like the first few episodes. I'm really sad about that, but it's fucking difficult uh, getting trying to do these combos. Oh shit, not this again. Uh, life up. Okay, now I'm having to use a lot more PSI than I would really like to, but you know what? It's for a good cause. It's so nobody dies. Get your HP back up, people. The end of the century? I'm sorry, what? Loser, loser, loser! Oh shit. Ah, uh, shield. Ah, Bonnie's gonna fucking die anyways. What's the point? If Bony gets fucking uh, shot down again, I'm just... Oh, would you look at that? He survived! He survived! Alright, uh, he's not surviving that one. No. Oh, way too soon. Actually. Actually. Oh, uh, no, no. Of, of course. Why wouldn't this asshole go before me? You know, fuck Lucas and everyone in this game. They are—they obviously hate me. Because there's no reason, no fucking reason for why I'm always the last person to go through. That just doesn't make any sense. Unless this game just really fucking hates Lucas for no reason. Oh my god, my PSI power is through the fucking shitter. Uh Ah oh, damn it. I think at this point in time I might I might just really need to go ham on this guy. Uh and there what hey, Bony's dead. Hey remember Bony? I don't. Never heard of him. Never heard of him. Uh let's see here, let's see here. Let's fuck this. And there goes Bony. Of course. Eat shit. It didn't hit anyone. Eat shit. Loser. Uh, if I see another fucking boss battle behind this asshole, I'm going to be livid. Why can I not hit anything? Uh, I honestly should probably just give something to Lucas so he can heal up on his whatchamacallit it on his uh, uh P PSI power PSI there we go there we go but I don't know Lucas is uh, was Lucas and Kumatora are the hardest hitters. Like, why wouldn't I want them attacking at all times? Oh, what that that kind of pisses me off. How how Lucas is one of my hardest hitters, yet I, he always has to be on recovery, whereas Duster and Boney are always the ones who are gonna have to hit him. I'm just super glad Boney is not on recovery duty because he would be terrible. No offense to you, Boney, but I I I can't sugarcoat it. You're you're awful. Even Jeff. 
even Lloyd, even Anna had <laughs> better fucking uses than you. I'm sorry, Bonnie, but that's just the truth. Ooh, what do we have here? What is this melody that I'm hearing? It sounds like something very familiar that I've listened to before. Is there maybe an instant reviling device nearby? Instant revitalizing device? Hot springs? I am low on HP, I am low on PSI power. Maybe if you can, you know, put an instant reviling device right like to the left of me to the right of me whichever one are you joking me i come all the way down over here and now you start you want to feel feverish fucking hell kumatora pk thunder omega all right cool 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 cool, cool. no instrument balancing device anywhere over here uh would you look at that the Runaway 5 tour bus? That looks like a Nessie over here. Yes, I'll board a boat. Oh, <laughs> Bunny's just sitting down over there. All right. Ooh, where have I heard this song before? Hmm. Anyways, yes, Nessie. There's a taxi. It looks like the phones from, again, Earthbound. The uh, fucking flying saucer that Jeff took, the eraser, uh, the eraser and the pencil, the helicopter from Monotoli. Dungeon man. And we also have the epic bus ride, the ATM machine, good old ATM machine, the submarine that we took for the dark, dark underground. The bicycle that I almost never got to use at all. The time distorter. Of course, the time distorter that he fucking stole. Hmm. I wonder where he got that nice little vehicle. Perhaps it was from somebody by the name of Gygus. And we also got the white and black sesame seeds from the from the desert. Can't believe he also decided to retrieve those. The most obscure things from the desert, and he decided to bring those back. The real question is, what did you do to Ness in this timeline? Because you had to have done something to him. Alright. For some reason, a pencil-shaped iron statue is blocking the path. It's <laughs> a good old pencil eraser. Actually, actually... I'm gonna get in this... I'm gonna get in here really quickly.